Nobody's dancing. Nobody's dancing but Miranda. We got a small class today. Thank you so much. Someone hired this lady as a worship leader. Kids worship leader. Interpretive dance. I can't do pelvic thrust anymore. She does it all. She does it all. kind of crazy because I had to bathe with gallon jugs of water. I didn't bathe. Marina didn't bathe. She's going to work out later. Powder fresh. <coughs> Stop, did you bathe? No. What? You took a shower last night, didn't you? <laughs> you took a shower last night at your but, house? But what does that mean? But what does it mean to take a shower? No, what? What does bathe mean? Bathe. Bathe means like to take a bath. What did you learn at your class? That I planted it and God made it grow. You planted a what? I planted a seed and God made it grow. Wells Valley Community Church. Visit us on Sundays. Late services at 10.30. Early services at 8.30. I'll be in the two and three year olds room. Can you okay. me, like, the triangle like this one? But we went to McDonald's afterwards. Mm -hmm. How many times have we been to McDonald's since you've been here? Just twice. Just twice. Because they have a play place. It's the only place in Fort Payne that has a play place. We'd yell at like ten different kids. I snitch one of them up. Where's your dad? Where's your daddy? What? What in the heck? You're so warm. What the heck? Sierra. Sierra. Here for you later. Hand me down. Hand <laughs> me down. Hand me down socks. Hand me down socks. That's gross. But anyways, after church, we went to McDonald's and then Walmart. And now we are here, kind of cleaning up, kind of just lounging. I fed the animals this morning, so I wouldn't have to right now. When I got stuff to make Josh a cake for when he gets home. Oh! And I haven't told y'all that I am actually surprising Josh at the airport. He does not know that I'm going with Daddy Jeff to pick him up. So he doesn't even know that I'm going to be there. Miranda's going to stay here with Cherokee. I'm going to go to the airport. It's going to be so much fun. But their flight lands at 11.47 Atlanta time. So that's 10.47 our time. <laughs> So we are leaving to go to the airport at 7 o'clock. And Miranda bought some crazy stuff for the girls to have a party while I'm gone. But I bought some little stuff to make Josh a cake, a welcome home cake. I got him this cute shirt. It has, it's a beard chart. Isn't that hilarious? So yeah, we're just killing time. I'm about to curl my hair. Before Josh gets home tonight, we're so excited. I love you. I am ready. We're about to leave to go pick them up. Uh, Miranda's staying here with Cherokee and Dot. Hey, are you going to babysit Cherokee for me? Um, yeah. Okay. Miranda is attempting to wash dishes. What? Miranda, I Man, know. I feel bad for you. I feel really bad. This is insane. Just put them out in the rain. To rinse them? I was thinking about it. No, what I'm going to do is get a funnel and like attach PVC to it 
and then like funnel the rain in. Wouldn't that, that's a good idea. I mean, how long would that take? Probably Maybe about four days. Probably. Where's Josh when I need him? Where is Josh when we need him? Coming home. He's in Texas right now. But they have a three-hour layover in Texas. Three-hour layover in Texas and the three-hour flight. She's saying wash. wash She's washing. Wash, wash, wash. Miranda feels bad for me. Um, because <coughs> you have way too much to do. No. Uh, oh, but wait, get this. I punched holes in this little plastic cup to make a little rinser. Wow, okay, wow, okay. In case you guys wanted to know. Wow. Well, yeah. Love you, thank you. Wash, wash, wash. Wash, wash, wash. Brenda's making fun of that I'm wearing sandals. Can somebody please, can somebody please hear me for a second? Sandals. She has the cutest booties in her closet right now. And she's wearing sandals in the rain in January. On the mountain. Going to the airport, you're going to start up in the airport in those bad, bad ideas bad <laughs> bad de and those bad decisions <laughs> listen I'm they're comfortable kidding. that's fine whatever that's not like your feet are even swollen no <clears throat> yes dot you want to take a bath in the rain we're going to take one in the sink the sink yes me too i'm going to sit in there with my big booty what Maybe y'all should keep the camera. <laughs>
Yeah, I know. 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 We got back to the house at probably 3.30 or 4. Because I think their flight was like 30 minutes or an hour. They didn't come out of the terminal until like 1 o'clock. No. Maybe it was 12. I don't know. But it was so much fun. I'm so glad that I got to go and see him and pick him up. And I'm so glad that he's home. Don't hit dot. Miranda said that these two girls had so much fun. So much fun. And they ate pizza and watched Spirit and got sink baths. For those of you who think I'm a city kid, oh wow, oh wow, this is two days without a shower. Oh, hey cats. I'm not a city kid. I took these, that giant five gallon bucket right there and let it fill with rainwater because it was raining last night and then I put it in a pot on the stove, boiled it, and let the girls take a bath. Not in the boiling water, obviously. In the uh, cleaned rainwater. I mean, we need to utilize the rainwater. I also have to go down to the river and dip it out. I even went to the bathroom in the woods today. When I got the pot, I had like this, what is that, like a three gallon pot or something. I put it on the stove. And Dot didn't see me bathe Cherokee, but I had put it in this, like poured it into the sink with some cooler water so it wouldn't burn him. And I was boiling the water right here on the stove, and then Dot said, "Mom, I'm not gonna fit in that pot." <laughs> I was like, "Yeah, I know. I'm gonna boil you like a lobster." But they fit just perfect in the little sink. It was so cute. Cherokee, who is that? Josh. She's being bashful. <laughs> There's Daddy. There's Daddy. She's being so funny. There's Daddy. Dawn can hardly contain her excitement right now. <laughs> Alright, I miss Dot. I got this right, for you. Now. <gasps> Ooh. You say thanks. Oh, thanks. Oh. That's nice. You want to put that one? I got a matching one of those for you and Cherokee. Oh. <gasps> that is cool. All the babies there had little bracelets on. Oh, so cute. Josh got checking these little leggings. In Honduras. Those are so cute. <laughs> oh my goodness, those are so cute. Oh, she's gone. Okay. <laughs> how do? You, how many limpiros were they? Seventy. And how many American dollars? Three. Look at her belly. a hundred limpiros is like four bucks. So. Miranda and Dot left this morning, um, or just a little while ago, actually, after Miranda got done working, husband. And I have just been chatting on the couch and I've just been like listening to stories of his trip and what his favorite stuff was and everything. And that's been really, really fun to just hear it firsthand instead of like over text or over the phone. So that's been amazing. It's I'm so glad to have him back. But now he is fixing the water with Steven. Um, and Cherokee's napping, so I'm gonna get my workout in while they're busy.
it looks like they are about finished with whatever they're fixing. So, I'm making a pizza for husband and a wrap for me. And what do you want to eat? Don't know. Oh, you want one of daddy's cupcakes? Okay. So here are some dishes that have accumulated over the past few days. And husband and Steven fixed the water. And there's no pressure. And I'm gonna wash these dishes. Miranda washed a ton of dishes yesterday, but we got some more accumulated. So yeah. This fine little lady is up from her nap. Husband is still napping because he is definitely sleep deprived. So we are about to work on some dinner and I'm making husband's, um, when we go to Outback, he always gets the same thing and it's the Al Springs chicken and I got a recipe, like a mock recipe. And thank you so much. And that's what I'm gonna make him for his first dinner back at home in the USA. I made this awesome dinner for Josh and he was so excited about it and I was so excited to make it for him, but he is now throwing up. So he will not be eating this tonight. I'm putting it in this little container and he will eat it when he feels better. But I really, really do not hope that he has a virus because I think a lot of the people on the missions trip that was with him got sick. So I hope he does not have any sickness, but I'll update you. He just threw his guts up, so maybe he feels better now. <laughs> 